Okay, so check it. Part of me is feeling good about myself because as of right now, today is uh, May the 4th, I do believe, and I am in my 10 month of being cigarette free. Now, that's a good thing to be happy and proud about. And believe me when I say after what I've been gone through, I am very happy and proud about that. But something that has happened because I've stopped smoking is I actually started picking up weight. So I'm on this kicking mission now and it started getting annoying to me because I don't want to be like this or whatever. I want to lose, especially this gut. Yeah, I got this gut here. I really need to lose. So in all lessons, the bottom line is the calorie intakes. You know what I'm saying? It's all about how much calories you burn and how much calories you take in. You know what I'm saying? You should be taking in less calories that you burn. That's how you're going to lose that weight. So I have to go do a whole new shopping regimen that I was doing in the very beginning. And then I started slacking on that. So I'm going to go to, uh, take my way up to the grocery store and uh, we're going to get back in the groove. All right? Come on, let's ride. Because in all honesty, in truth, it's really all about being happy about myself and all about getting to not just the whole smoking thing, but just being physically healthy, period. You know, the older you get, I understand that, that the older we get, the uh, more we need to pay more attention to that. We probably need to, we, I was paying attention when I was at the younger age, but you know, sometimes, you know, our body just gets slower down and that's not an excuse. I know that. And you're talking to somebody who's been smoking for over 20 something years and finally stopped just like that. I, I don't know if you call it a cold turkey or whatever. I was in the hospital, doctor said stop. I said stop. <laughs> when you when you land back like that and you realize, you know, what your alternatives are, you kind of look back and say, yeah, okay, Game's a, uh, game is over, you know what I'm saying, let's get on the ball, let's have a ball, let's do it all, so, get back on the other kick, and you know, I didn't got into that work, picking back up on work, because I was working out great in the beginning, but picking back up on working out, jumping on that treadmill, and um, doing what needs to be done. So I'm going to go up into this giant grocery store right here. I guess that's a plug for them, you know. Only because I'm because they're closer to me right now, so that's what I'm going to do. So let's let's ride and do this thing, okay? sure that I do not forget and it ain't these cookies behind me you can best believe that Chick over here look kind of fly, man. 
might try to holler at her. It's always a good place. Where she go? It's always a good place to, uh, always a good place to, uh, find some beautiful women. <laughs> yeah. And that's basically how we're going to do this. You know what I'm saying? It's, uh, always something, but got to keep in form, got to keep in shape, and got to get myself back to the way the old Kato used to be. That love and sexy loving machine, you know what I'm saying? And I don't mean just loving it as far as uh, intercourse, but just loving in life, you know what I mean? Alright, got the junk from John and stuff like that. Came up to 40 something. Uh, called me Chippy One. I didn't want to spend that much, but I had to have something to eat. <laughs> so, <laughs> I guess it. I guess the investment is worth it if it's going to do what I needed to do and have me stop ordering, ordering takeout. That's what's been killing me. I'm be real honest. So, um, you know, and I'm gonna be, to be perfectly honest about this, I'm gonna be real honest and say that I got remotivated again in doing this and getting this uh, based on a, a guy who actually does YouTube clips. Uh, go by the name of Obese to Beast. Real awesome and uh, inspiring young guy. You know what I'm saying? He keeps in shape. He was pretty, pretty large guy, and he really <laughs> became a pretty small guy. But he was talking about a clip I was watching recently called um, your T-D-E-E. -E. And your T-D-E-E, -E -E, basically, I can't remember what it stands for, but it's, it basically is the total amount of calories that you burn, that your body burns a day. So the whole point is measuring. And there's a site. I'll put the site in the um, description below. That you could go to this site and you can get information basically they give you a bunch of questions and you answer those questions uh it's honest you have to be honest okay the whole thing is about being honest so you answer those questions and then it tells you what your total tdee is basically the total amount of calories that you burn they'll ask questions such as your age how much exercise you do your weight and all that kind of stuff your size and all that just be honest with them you know what I'm saying? If you're not doing any exercise, say I'm not doing any exercise. So it can be accurate and it can give you an accurate amount of TDEE. Um, my TDEE, in all honesty, because the older I am or whatever, was pretty, pretty kind of low. It was actually around 2200, something like that. So that's basically how much calories the body naturally burns regularly during the day. And the object is, is to eat less calories that your body burns so the whole thing is i'm gonna have to start measuring i never measured before you know i never had a reason to because there used to be a time when i could eat all i want but we know how metabolism works when you get older what you do is you get that tdee number mine was like i say 22 something and you kind of eat much less calories you gotta count like i say you gotta count so my whole thing is going to be seeing how much I can do eating no more than 1,700 calories a day. And um, we're going to see how that go. Plus, you know, working out like I normally do, doing the treadmill thing. I usually do like a, a mile or a mile and a half on the treadmill. And um, we're going to see how that works out. And um, wish me well, keep me in prayer and all that kind of stuff until I get there. All right? God bless you. You be cool.